Hi Scorpio, welcome to my channel, Trying Divine Tarot. And I have already smoked my decks. I've anointed my wrists and we are pretty much ready to go. Um, this reading will be for Scorpio. Sun. I've been using, today I've been using uh, Oracle decks I've created myself and they've been pretty juicy. So we're gonna go ahead and pull a few for Scorpio. And then we'll probably uh, clarify with some tarot, okay? Please remember to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Leave a comment down below if anything like this resonates with you. Ooh, we have single and <laughs> single is a Pringle ready to mingle, 100% available. Ooh, Scorpio's like, oh no. All right, Scorpio. <laughs> Another one for Scorpio, please. Oh, it says, I'm sorry. Okay, I love this card, and it hasn't come out today in all the zodiacs. Okay, so this is very special, and it's nice that it's coming out for Scorpio. Okay, this is what it says. God has not forgotten you. You are one of God's favorites. Move forward without fear as the creator has silenced the enemy. I love this. I love this card. Okay, we're gonna do one more. For Scorpio. Okay, this just got stuck. I don't think this, well, I'll take, maybe I'll take, <laughs> maybe I'll take all three because they're pretty, they're pretty good. Okay, I'll take them. I usually just do four, but we're going to take these, okay? It says magic at the, magic at the library, enchanted encounter. I'm hearing sparks fly, you know? Magic at the library. Enchanted encounter, well, mainly. Magical enchanted encounter is what I'm getting from this. And then we have, I don't rattle easy, but you make me nervous. I'm dropping my guard for you. And then we have, you win it all. Hold on one second. Okay, I'm back, sorry for that Scorpio. Okay, so we had magic at the library, enchanted encounter. You may be researching something. You may be looking through a catalog, a catalog of some sort, uh, educating yourself on something and you came across or I don't know something about an enchanted encounter or something spiritual you may have encountered something spiritually just recently um, you may have went up another notch on your spiritual awakening process Encount enchanted encounter you know, it could be, you know, that went along with this really beautiful card that came out with you. And of course, and, it, and I have very few cards that are in blue. So this is very scorpion. And then the other cards you received were, I don't rattle easy, but you make me nervous. And I'm dropping my guard for you. 
Scorpio always has their guard up. They're a fixed sign. They're very guarded. They're very in control. But somebody makes a Scorpio nervous, okay? <laughs> but I think you might be winning over this person, or they may be winning over you. But we'll see. Let's pull out. There's an apology here. Um, we have, I'm sorry, literally, I am sorry that came out and I think you want to let somebody know that you are single and ready to mingle <laughs> and available because this person may have been getting mixed signals from you or vice versa. Okay. What is single as a Pringle ready to mingle for a Scorpio? We have parking lot or pull up beside your car. This could be that enchanted encounter, or you're taking a drive someplace. It says, no weapon formed against me shall prosper. Okay, and I'm gonna link that with the God has not forgotten you card. Because you may have been going through something like spiritually maybe that's why you've been doing you know the word library you've been really doing research or educating yourself on something maybe something happened to you that you couldn't explain so you're you know researching it trying to make sense out of it or you had something, you know, a tower moment of some sort. You may be sitting in your car. I'm hearing like research or and either you're doing this on your phone or you actually have books. Like you're actually reading. Like you're taking your time out and like, I like to do that too. Like sometimes just sitting in your car with your music on by yourself is a mini vacation all on its own, okay? like. <laughs> Seriously, um, and maybe that's what you're doing. I'm sorry for the background noise. Um, I have two kids, um, a boy and a girl, and they're playing basketball in the kitchen. <laughs> okay. Um, So yeah, single as a Pringle, I'm like, single as a Pringle, like, I think you're just really focused on yourself right now and taking an opportunity for yourself. You might be going through, like I said, like some sort of like spiritual awakening or on your next level of your awakening. You may have had um, some sort of encounter or godly encounter of some sort. And I'm seeing you really being in touch with your spirituality right now. 
and educating yourself. To, for me, it's like you're doing a lot of praying. And the I'm sorry card, I don't know if that's an apology coming to you or that's an apology you you want to make to somebody else. Or you're asking God for forgiveness. I'm I don't know. But no weapon formed against you shall prosper. Oh. Sometimes we get visits from the angels and sometimes we get visits from that darker realm, especially if you're into spirituality. And those darker ones can scare you. Um, but they're necessary in your journey so you can identify the enemy. I've had these things happen to me as well. But they're for your higher good. They make you a better spiritualist. So you know what to protect yourself from. And God's letting you know if you're a spiritual warrior, what you're up against. It's necessary. But God will always let you know, no weapon formed against you shall prosper. The weapon may be formed. The weapon is out there, okay? But it's not going to hurt you. You are one of God's favorites. All right, what else for Scorpio? Oh, and also this beautiful card of you win. <laughs> okay, Scorpio, whatever you had your sights on, it's yours. Okay, you win. You win. All right, Scorpio. A few more for Scorpio. Okay, um, these two cards came out. It says, you are an amazing parent doing your best. You may have kids. If you do have kids, the Lord is acknowledging that you are an amazing parent and you're doing the best. You're doing the best that you can. You're doing the best with what you have. And you need to hear this. I'm feeling like this is a Scorpio going through something, okay? And if you don't have kids, then pay attention to the top portion of this card. You are amazing. And God wants you to know that as well. I can go back to that really special card I read it twice already. You know what it says. <laughs> you're amazing. And in, if you have kids, you're an amazing parent. And if nobody has told you that, I'm telling you that. God acknowledges that. And it needed to, to be said to you. Okay? Yeah, this is a spirit message. It says, I see you, but you don't see me. School or in passing. This could be a message coming through from a past loved one for you through me. I 
I see you, but you don't see me. School or in passing. Okay, so this person could have passed and you're getting a message this way that you needed to hear. The school, um, is this education that I'm, I've been talking about in this reading? Um, I don't know if there's a Scorpio like reading up on their spirituality, they're like reading their Bible or, you know, their spiritual teachings, you know, whatever. Bible is in their religion. Um, but know that somebody is watching over a Scorpio, whether it's their angelic team, whether it's the creator themselves. They acknowledge you that you are doing your best. And that you're amazing. <laughs> okay. So. Clarify, I'm sorry for Scorpio. I don't know why I'm hearing like you're asking for forgiveness or asking God for forgiveness or somebody that you're interested for forgiveness. This card can go many different ways. Clarify, I'm sorry for Scorpio. I don't know if this applies. said they made lots of money off of you. I'm sorry. For Scorpio, please. I'm only taking the one that's on top, but another word that it's peeking out is property. And it says, your neighbors are psycho. Maybe you have your neighbors want to apologize or something. So that was the card and it's uh, the card underneath was property. So maybe somebody was messing with your property that says your neighbors are psycho or somebody you know is psycho and doing psycho shit. I don't know. They speak, okay? It says they will be called in for questioning the police have made their presence known. Okay. So there's like, you know, the reads I do don't just stay on one subject. They, you know, there's other issues at hand that come in. So somebody wants to apologize, somebody, something may have been done to your property, but it says like your neighbors are psycho. So either you're dealing with some psychos Whatever they did, they've, they've been caught and they're coming, they're going to be questioned because the law is involved now. Yeah. 
and I think your spiritual team has ushered in this protection for you. Because whatever the situation is, I just feel like the Scorpio is going through something. And they're going through this healing with spirituality and education. And know that your spirit team and God acknowledges all your hard work. And um, they're very proud of you. Like, I'm feeling like a lot of people, like, but not only your spirit team, people that you interact with, they're very proud of you too. And once again, this needed to be said. To a Scorpio that may be going through a hard time right now. So, everyone thinks you're amazing. You're doing your best if you're a parent. And there's no worries, okay? All right. Many blessings to the Scorpio. I'm going to leave it there. And um, we'll see you next time, okay? Ciao.